What's up, everybody? It's March the 9th. It is March the 9th, guys. By the time you see this video, it'll probably be way past that. But anyway, guys, it's 6.30 in the morning. And I'm on my way to work, guys, doing my J-O-B. You know J-O-B means just over broke, right? That's what J-O-B means, guys. You're just over broke unless you save a lot of money. And then today's world, man, it's hard to save a lot of money because things always happen. The tidal wave is always coming. Even when the seas are calm, man, even when the sun is shining, that wave is coming. Believe me, guys. I'm not trying to uh, pour spirits or, or, or sadness on you or what's going on in your life, man. But the wave is always coming in life today. And you got to be prepared, man. You know, proud planning prevents poor performance, right? Well, anyway, guys, the reason why I, I decided to do this video on the way to work, you know, this little section of the vlog, is because it just reminds me what kind of world we living in, man. And how fast the world is moving. And a lot of times people say, what do you mean by that? My kids we used to ask me that. What do you mean always fat, the world is fast moving? Because nobody has time for nothing. We're busy. We got two and three jobs. We're trying to take care of our family. We're trying to pay our bills. We got family events, right? We got a lot of things going on. We got emergencies in our life that happen. You know, people get sick. The world is just moving, 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 moving. And we don't take the time to smell the flowers, guys. I just saw this car, man. The light was red for a long, long time, right? We weren't even close to the light. He gets to the light, it's still red. And a good thing there's no traffic because it's early in the morning, right? It's not, you know, barely any traffic. This guy goes right through the light. Didn't even yield. Didn't even yield, guys. He went straight through the light. And I understand, you know, we're, we're in a hurry. We're trying to get to work. I know he's probably probably running behind late trying to get to work, not being late because, you know, when you get late so many times, they want to write you up and they want to just give you discipline. Di discipline it. Anyway, discipline. And uh, when you're late and stuff like that and give you warnings and all this kind of stuff and make you sign uh, discipline sheets or give you a warning because you get so many warnings, you get fired or laid off or suspended. Well, anyway, guys, you know, and I know it's just, you know, he was probably in a hurry. But what I'm saying is, guys, even when I'm in a hurry, I will not run a red light like that. I will not. And I know we all have different uh, uh, feelings, different pressures, different stresses, and we all react differently. But, guys, I'm trying to get back to what the kind of world we're living in, guys. He went right through that light. Didn't even, I can see if he, you know, Sometimes we, we, we just do things we shouldn't do sometimes. We all do that, guys. We're not perfect. And I'm not trying to say I'm perfect. I make, I make mistakes. I make illegal U-turns and stuff like that. But what I'm saying, guys, is the world is just moving fast. Not that I'm blaming that guy that read the red light, but he didn't even yield, guys. It could have been somebody coming through that, coming through that intersection. It could have been a big truck. It could have been anything coming through that intersection, guys. But he didn't even yield. That's the, the desperatality, I don't know if that's the word, the desperatality to, to get where he was going or you get to the point where people just don't want to stop anymore because we are moving too fast. That's why I tell my wife, if that when you're going through that red light and it's getting ready to turn green, wait a second. Don't just fly through there because you got the green light because somebody doesn't want to stop. There's somebody in a hurry. There's somebody that's saying, I got to get to work or whatever. Or it could be somebody drinking. Give give it like two or three seconds before you take off. Screw the people behind you that might blow the horn, because that's another thing. People are sore in a hurry, they will blow that horn. As soon as that light turns green, if you take one second and not move, and you guys probably experienced it, somebody's gonna blow that light behind you. Okay? But take a second before you before you go through that light because you got green, because somebody might be flunk, trying to get through that red, guys. And they and they can't stop in time and they're gonna hit you. So always take a few seconds before you get through that red, that green light, guys, because people are in a hurry. And if you take one second, when your light turns green to take off, they're going to blow the horn. I guarantee you. Do that test. When, that, when your light turns green, take one second before you move your car and watch somebody blow that horn. People in a hurry, guys. So I just want to give you that little tidbit. It was on my mind. I'm on my way to work to do my gist over broke. Y'all take it easy.